I'm now going to put the salt across the top of this and make it, um, you know, sit on top of this earth as if it did form as a salt crust on top of earth. And I'm only just blocking this underpainting out now so that I don't have to do it again. So the thing will now take shape. I, I'm not really sure what's going to happen to it. I've got a fair idea. As I do with all my paintings, they, uh, they're just an idea and they're in your head and that's what painting's all about and you have to get it out. So it's a, it's a work pro process. There's no, uh, there's no answer to it. You just uh, go along and get into the, the mood of it and just and see what comes out. Um, and that's, that is one of the joys in uh, creating. There's no pre preconceived idea. So once again, this is an early, early, just a, a background getting paint on the canvas. And then I'll start to get these nice, uh, this is what I was after, the, the lines, that are, the wire that's sort of uh, interplaying with the, with the salt lake and the way it's, the beautiful shapes are coming out. So it's nearly an abstract feeling um, with movement just going through the thing. I'm not sure what's going to happen after that. I'm just, um, that's where we're up to now. I paint uh, five, day, oh, five to six days a week, and I start at nine o'clock, sort of, you know, you get up in the morning, you do your thing, walk the dog, and, and I treat this just like a job. Um, I come in at nine and I'll start working. There's no point, I find, in waiting for inspiration. Um, it, it's just not gonna hit you like a lightning bolt. You have to actually start working. Once you go into the working process, other things come along and you go from there. Um, the, the, the fact that you're actually working and painting, this will lead me to another idea and I'll pick up another canvas and just start on that. And, and before I know it, you know, the day's over, it's, it's five o'clock and I'm really wanting to work, but it's too late. Uh, I don't paint after dark because I rely on natural light. I have painted underneath fluorescent lights and different things. And the next morning, the paint's completely different. So you, you just have to work with the natural lights which is a good thing too, because you get time off and you can, you know, chill out and uh, do whatever you do, watch telly or read a book or something like that. So it is, it's a daily, uh, a daily thing for me. Um, if I'm not painting, I'm either in the gallery just doing a few bits and pieces in there or I'm uh, out researching other ideas, which is a major part of uh, being an artist. You need that inspiration.